good reason. She's the founder of Dylan's Candy Bar right here in New York and now going everywhere. Yeah. And he really brought something special for us today. This is the Magic Candy Factory. What is that? This is so cool. It's the first 3D gummy printer that we are launching at Dylan's Candy Bar and we're the first in America to have it. It prints candy that's vegan, kosher, and dairy free. <laughs> it prints in five minutes your logo, which is Good Morning good America. Morning America there. So you your, can personalize You this. can personalize. And that's a huge thing right now, especially in candy. Everything we do at Dylan's Candy Bar, we're finding customers go to our personalized shop and they go and they want to design their own you know, fillable or their own invitation or their own party favor. So Magic Candy Factory is one of these great items that allows you to send in your portrait. If you go on Dylan'sCandyBar.com, you could literally see your face, which you'll see after. We made it in vegan candy. Um, and then you could, you know, send it as a gift. Michael, look, you're looking good. <laughs> your face in candy. So, you know, personalizing is just a big thing. And, and so, you know, on Dylan'sCandyBar.com, we let you do that. And people just love it. It's, and they love candy. So, so cool. We love this. Thank Got a lot you. of big treats here today, yes. starting with these, what, marbleized popsicles? Yeah, so these are really just a healthy summer alternative. Um, we're going to make some of them. They are basically, you take yogurt and you put some honey in it. If you want to try. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's the honey first. Honey and cream. And then you mix it. Do it really fast. Just a little bit of cream. And first, first you mix it. I think I use too much cream. It's, you know what? <laughs> I Joy. like more honey in mine just so it's sweeter. Mm -hmm. And then what you want to do once you're done with that is you, yeah, make it a little sweeter. You will layer in um, a little bit of the yogurt part mm -hmm. in a cup. And then what you want to do is layer in any fresh fruit. There's a cup of blueberries we have here and a cup of raspberries. So just a, a little what bit do you of think? that. Yeah, just okay. a little bit of that. And then add another layer of the yogurt mixture. Okay. So what you want to create Easy. is sort of a stripe like yeah. an American flag. I tend to, you know, like both it fruits yeah. in it. So I'm going to mix it up again. <laughs> and then and then it ends up looking like this once you stick the popsicle in. You have to obviously refrigerate right. it, and then you'll unpeel refrigerate, it. Refrigerate, not freeze. You will, oh, you'll freeze it freeze just it. for an hour to two hours, and then you stick the popsicle, and it ends up looking like that. There we go. Okay. Voila. So the next one. Oh, you gave him over to me. What, yeah. are, we, what are we making, Dylan? I know you're the candy man. I'm the candy man. I come to your <laughs> store all the time with my girls. They love it. They wear have a backpack. They have everything from Thank your store. I, I appreciate that. So this, we're making these truffles, white chocolate truffles with lemon zest. This is what you're going to do. You take butter and white chocolate, and you pour some of the, um, the heavy cream and corn syrup into the mixture. Well, this is then, it is, then you refrigerate it. Okay. And then, and then, so this has sort of been done because it's hot out here, not like a kitchen. Okay. So it ends up looking like this after about an hour of refrigeration. You stick your ice cream scooper in. You take a little ball, plop it in sanded sugar, and then you roll it around. And it forms these beautiful truffles that end up looking like this. They could be white chocolate or lemon zest. Wow. And then it's delicious. They could eat it. Woo. I agree. Woo. It's very delicious. Yeah. <laughs> that's very easy. That's easy to make. Too. They're all so easy. Oh and God, I, yeah. so and I love sweets. So it's fruit and sweets. It's healthy. It's good. That's incredible. All right. This now we've is, got fresh watermelons. Yeah. Here. What are we making? So watermelon's big in the summer. We're making watermelon fruit roll-ups. Okay. You take oh. some sugar, two to three cups. You put it in eight cups of cubes of watermelon. Watermelon. Okay. Cover it. Okay. Don't forget to cover it. Yes. <laughs> and then you blend it. You want to puree it so that it forms. It forms a soft puree. Uh -huh. Ends up looking like this. Okay. You want to strain it so all the watermelon seeds come out and that the puree and the juice is left. Okay. And then. This is obviously faster than it happens. You you take the extra puree, you put it on a cheesecloth and a parchment paper. Okay. And you lay it down about one eighth inch thick. Whoa. And then you could cut it, which will we could cut it here or in this oh, thing. Right here. Yeah. They, you roll it on the and it's a fruit roll up, a watermelon roll up. Fruit roll up. Do you want to try it? Oh, that's incredible. Yeah. All healthy. It's all you know. All these things from the Magic Candy Factory to these different fruit things are all healthy and they're sweet. And they, obviously, they I love candy. They taste too. really good. Really good. Yeah. <laughs> so, thank you. Thank for coming you. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Have a sweet summer. Yeah, <laughs>